Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Shalonda and this is Saving with Shalonda. Hello to all my returning subscribers and welcome to all the new subscribers. Thank you guys for being here. I'm coming on to show you guys how I um, clean my um, heat book, okay? My laminated pages and things like that because this is another requested video about like getting all the coloring off of here and stuff like that. So if that sounds like something that you're interested in, keep on watching. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Go ahead and smash the like button because you're going to like and you're going to love this video. Be sure to leave me some comments below. Be sure to watch the ads that play throughout the video and share my video. All right, so so we're here on the cover page of my, or my savings tracker page in my heat book. So the first thing I usually do to start my week off, because like I said, I'm going to start playing games today. Um, so we're starting a new week of games. So I'm going to come over and transfer my numbers, okay? So if I'm gonna clean these circles off here, okay? The smaller circles, and then I'm gonna transfer these numbers over here once I clean these off and then wipe those clean. So these are my last ending total, so I want those there now, okay? So what I've done is, this is a magic eraser. I've already broken it in half. I got the other half soaking in the, some warm water, okay? Off to the side. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean my bubbles out now, okay? All right, I'm gonna go down here as well. And we just wanna update our totals for the start of the week, things like that. You know, you gotta put your back into it a little bit, scrub a little hard, guys. Let's see. Trying to make sure I played everything. I, sh I didn't update my bingo or dice of darts, so I'm gonna leave those on there, total-wise. Okay, everything else is played. All right, so that's the first step. So I'm gonna dry those off with a paper towel, tissue, whatever you have towels. Okay, I got some tissue right here. Okay. So that's that. And then like I said, using a fine tip Sharpie, I'm going to transfer my numbers over. So in here. Because these are smaller circles in the white boxes, okay? Go look see what that one is <laughs> okay super saving 23 that should be 21 most likely right 31 like i said guys these numbers aren't like perfect perfect you know to the day but like i said they're they're close to what the numbers actually should be because like i said i make mistakes like we all do but to give you any ind indication of how much you say to each game these are close enough okay 29.5 Okay, so we did that not fine tip sharpie. We transferred all our numbers over. Now we're gonna go ahead and do the white blocks here. Dip it into some water again. And like I said, you gotta put your back into it to get it to come completely clean. <laughs> Like I said, uh, Magic Eraser is by far the easiest way to um, get these books clean, okay, or laminated items. All right, looking good, and we'll go ahead and do these over here.
So, as good as new. So, like I said, now our tracker is ready for the week now. We have our totals from last week, and so we're ready to start playing our games. So, like I said, I'm going to tell you that's the number we started with. And then when I play the games, that we say you say $5 that round. So, 52 plus 5 is going to be our new total for the week 57. Okay? So, that's how we do the savings tracker. Get it ready for the week. Now... We're gonna go ahead and clean these. I'm gonna pull, actually pull this out of here. I'll put it on the table, guys. So we'll do this one first. All right. Because we're starting over new month. So you just go at it. <laughs> put you back into it and clean it, guys. <laughs> Like I say, you go over it as much as you feel like you need to to get it completely clean. But like I said, you got to put your back into it to get it <laughs> the way you want it, okay? But like I said, for the sake of the video, that's pretty good. And then you go back and dry it off, guys. Put a towel or paper towel or something, okay? <clears throat> All right. Gotta put this back in our book. All right. So like that. So now we're on this page, which has a lot of different colors on here and darker colors. Okay. Same process for the most part. Like I said, you're probably, like I said, going to have to buy you some magic erasers in bulk because you probably won't be able to reuse this after today, okay? But all these colors coming off of here. Like I said, do your initial clean, then you'll go back over it and do it again. Just, you know. So you definitely got to put your back into it, guys. <laughs> but we love our reusable books, guys. So we don't have to buy another book. And we don't have to print it out any more pages. Okay? We just got to clean them. <laughs> so we can replay our games as much as we want. Definitely an arm workout, guys, okay? <laughs> I'm feeling the burn.
Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Peg me out, yeah. Okay, I'm probably gonna switch on the other half of the eraser in a second. Okay, if I feel like it's not working that well. Like I said, buy you some magic erasers in bulk, guys, especially if you have my book and you play frequently, okay? For all your challenges, guys. So they come in handy. Okay, let me wipe this off a little bit. Now, I guess I'm gonna do another, the other half of the eraser. Like I said, that one is pretty soiled, okay? Oh, the bleach might be out of it already, all right? <laughs> the magic eraser nest, okay? So I'm, like I said, going over to the new one. Other half of it. So let's see how this one does. Let's clean it up a little bit better. Hey guys, you gotta dig into it. <laughs> Especially like these, like the blues and stuff, the darker colors that, you know. Now, to avoid having to do a lot of this, use lighter colors, okay? <laughs> If you don't want to put your back into it, okay? Use lighter, sharpie colors, and it'll come off better, okay? But for those of us who love color and we don't mind, you know, getting our hands a little dirty, okay? You you do it this way. Use whatever color you want, but you got to work at the end, okay? <laughs> All right. I'm going to dry that off like that. They're pretty decent. All right. Good as it's gonna get for right now for me, cause my arm hurt, okay? <laughs> but now we'll put our page back into our book. Kinda wipe this up, got a little wet back here. All right, place it back into our book. Okay, like I said, we're ready to start our um, new month. So we're ready to start April now. Like I said, I'm gonna go through my book now to see what I'm updating. Like I mentioned, guys, I told you guys that I'm gonna be playing my challenges um, lower income this month. So instead of the one or two dollars we're gonna play, we're gonna um, decrease our bets to 50 and a dollar, okay? So we're gonna half all of our bets. So that's one thing we'll be changing this month. But we're gonna continue the gameplay wherever it's at right now. We're still gonna play it the same exact way. And then next month, we'll go back to the next amount that we're gonna be playing for, okay? But we're going to do just a continuation of the game we're already playing. So this was 50 cent. I'm going to take each dice to 25 cent. Okay. Because we do 10 pools. Okay. So instead of $5 game, it's going to be a $2.50 game. Okay. So I'm basically just having all my bits for April. Okay. Cleaning up any other stuff that kind of may, may came over here. Like from the last game, the color game. And then I'm, we had 25, 50, 75. We might make this a dime game here, guys. And let's do, we're going to change this to 10, 20, 30 cent. Okay. Right, this is 50 and a dollar, so it's going to 25 cent and 50 cent for our bet. Now, 
Okay, so our alphabet game, we were playing 25 cent. We're gonna do a list of 10 cent instead. And for right now, cause we'll be, we should be completing some words over this course of this month with that bet. So we're just gonna do 50 cent when we complete a word this time, okay? And then, like I said, next month, we'll change it back to the other numbers at the continuation of the game, okay? We, we don't wanna stop. We ain't gonna go, st you know, stop challenges just to stop them because we don't have enough money to play them or how we feel about it. We just gonna continue and keep going and complete the page and start over again, okay? But like I said, you don't always have the same amount of money to save each time, okay? So these were at one, two, and three. I'm gonna do, like I said, I'm gonna half everything. So let's just do five, one, and then 150, okay? There we go. We, we, want, we want to have fun, guys, okay? We still want to play our games and have the same amount of fun, okay? So we're going 50, 150, okay? Same thing. We got, the game still play the same way, regardless of your income, guys. Now let me draw that off a little bit more. That's gonna go from 25 and 50, okay, from, so half in these, so. All right. And that is it, guys. So those are the games uh, for the signature games. So like I said, I'm, I'm correcting that I'm. A, I just wanted to show you how I'm doing this in the video. But the goal is to go through the entire book. I'm going to um, re-sticker anything that needs stickers on it. I probably can do one scratch off with you guys real quick to clean a page off. Let's see. They need to be re-stickered. That's not done all the way yet. Let's do, let's do, let me see if I get my gold stickers over here. Yeah, we'll re-sticker this one right here, okay? So, with the scratch house, I think I might, may have removed all the clear plastic. If you can see these, you can see kind of like a circle from the uh, scratch off sticker that's still there. And so I'm gonna try to remove these the best I can, okay? Now here it is coming off. Let's see guys. I don't have any nails. <laughs> okay, I have the second one off of there. Like I said, I can't get it off or I just leave it <laughs> so to the next go round, guys. <laughs> and I just re-stickered my games, guys, okay? So normally I would take, um, now you could try to take this to get some of this like glue off of here a little bit before you put your new stickers down. You can use your scratch off tool too to try to break it up. So you just kind of wet your sponge here. Trying to get this little black off from the glue. Okay, so that works. Like I said, you're gonna take the stickers completely up if you can. Um, use your scratch off tool to break up any like little glue. Then use your sponge to um, remove like the black glue and so, it's the, so the surface is smooth. Then you reapply your scratch off stickers, guys, to preserve your books or your laminated items, okay? 
and restore it back to their original beauty. That's why these books are lifelong, guys, okay? You can have them forever. All right, so like I said, it's gonna be a little sticky there, okay? So I'm going to, let's see. I'm using my scratch shots too a little bit. All right, then I'm gonna get my sponge, dip it in some water, and so I can remove all the residue, get a little liquid on there to break it up. And scrubbing at you, you can just kind of like see it, okay? Like I said, put the knuckles in it. <laughs> like I said, you see the little black line from the blue residue is moving. Okay, we've been cleaned up. But that's essentially what you want to do, guys. Okay, and then you just clean it till it's smooth as you want it. Okay, like I said. I, I continuously apply scratch off stickers to these, so I'm not gonna worry about it too much and stuff. But if it gets like too out of control, I, I will clean it and it takes real, some real time. But since we're on camera, guys, I'm not gonna do all that. I'm just gonna recover my sticker, reapply my stickers. Like I said, if you wanna reapply your stickers, buy you a roll, rolls of stickers off Amazon, okay? You don't have to put the gold ones on there. You can put any color. Like I said, you get the silver, the gold, the holographic stickers, whatever floats your boat. They got color stickers. So whatever you want to do, guys, okay? It's up to you. The world is your playground, okay? So basically, like I said, this is what you want to do for a scratch off to clean your page up. Like I said, as you can see, that can be quite time consuming. And things like I said, but like I said, I play these challenges all the time. And like I said, by the end of the month, as we're playing at even lower denominations, these probably should be done, okay? And then we'll have to redo it again anyway. So here we go. But I just wanted to show you the steps that you need to take to care for your laminated book and items to restore it back to its original beauty, okay? So there you go. Good as new. Not to look good, okay? <laughs> just like the first day you had it, okay? <laughs> So that is it, guys. Basically, like I said, um, I showed you how to clean off the trackers, how to redo your numbers, how to reapply your scratch off or care for your scratch off pages in here. Like I said, when you don't have a lot of money, you can still play your game. Just change the amounts. Don't feel bad about changing the amounts to fit your budget at that time. When you get more money, go back to the um, way you were playing, but you can finish, finish the game. Don't end them. Just finish them like they were. And stuff like that. Like I said, we'll put a twenty-five fifty in here. Or if you want to, if you're really keeping track, but the tracker is at the front keeping track. The money in your envelope is what's keeping track of how much you save. Don't worry about what the actual challenge says. Okay, the money is in the envelope already, guys. Okay, so that is that, guys. And like I said, I'm just gonna go through here. Like I said, clean up more of my sheets. Like I need to do eight ball because all the games are finished on here, and do a few more of these. And you know, that's it. But that's how my week usually starts on my Sunday, if I remember to. Trying to go through my books to remember uh, what I need to clean off if I can. Like I said, I need to resticker this one here for pool size. I'm going to clean some of these off with the... Uh, I'm going to remove some more of this with the um, scratch off tool first before I actually apply the stickers to these, okay? And then that's it, guys. But that is um, what I'm about to be working on sometimes like part of today as well or as i get to to film on these videos that i need to film for the uh for, for you guys okay so i wanted to come on and show you the process because like i said i have been asked about uh how to care for your books okay and so i just wanted to make sure that this video is out here so like i said we did our tracker today and we cleaned our uh took the colors off of here okay with the deep color so like i said good as new guys so it's ready to be played all right so i'm going to end this video here so i can get ready to actually start filming your videos for this week okay <laughs> 
now that we cleaned up our book. All right. So you guys um, enjoy your day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.